Make sure to subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. Side on Sports Center. I don't know if this is a bold declaration. Uh -oh. Talking about Josh Allen, Bills quarterback. Yeah. I believe right now, you give me any quarterback in the NFL, I'm taking Josh Allen. First, forward. I think he's the best quarterback in the league as we speak. I think he's definitely up there for sure. But you're telling me that you would take him over Mahomes yes. right now? Yes. Yes. Aaron Rodgers right now. Tom yes. Brady maybe. Heard Speaking of him. Of wow. Football Friday, 44-year-old Tommy. He's mastered time. We'll see how well he's mastered space. How about you starting off the show like that? And fresh off the loss to Brady's Bucks, Zach Ertz. He has his green eagle feathers traded for red cardinal ones. Wow. Mm. What this addition means for Kyler Murray in Arizona, Sports Center begins right now. But would I take Josh Allen over Jake Foreman? <laughs> With another convincing performance by Tom Brady and company. Surprise, surprise. So now. The Buccaneers get to sit back and watch the rest of the best like the rest of us. Will the Cardinals remain undefeated? Will the Cowboys, Packers, and Chargers keep pace with the one-loss Buccaneers? There's also a rivalry game in Denver as the Broncos host the Raiders with all eyes, of course, on how Vegas responds after one of the more difficult weeks in franchise history. That's where we begin our Week 6 Sports Center huddle. Here's Paul Gutierrez. I look forward to that debate. Matt, very safe deal here with you. Headlines. Uh, yeah, what a great Thursday night in sports. Mm. You had all the NFL, you had college, and then you had some baseball. That was a winner-go-home game. I mean. With the two best teams in the sport. It's one of those nights where it's okay to be lazy. Yeah. Put your feet up and enjoy it. And what a game. What an boo. Well, it should because it's a rematch from last season's NLCS. If you recall, the Dodgers were down three games to one before coming back to punch their ticket to the World Series. Also, both of these teams have both been powerhouses since the trade deadline. Dodgers own the best record, best run differential. The Braves are right behind them, ranking third in both of those categories. This would be the best team in <laughs> NBA history. Just saying. Uh, by the way, we always talk about best times of the year to be a sports fan. Oh. And right now, we're in the thick of it with college football. We're in the thick of it with the NFL. NHL just started up, and now you have the NBA. I mean, this, you this, could is, argue. this is heaven. I'm just saying. It doesn't take much to please us, but we like it. Speaking of it, it is a, a football Friday. Week six. Right? Let's go. Let's go.